Welcome y'all to Jukes. Evidently in Polish, DZ comes out ja. Hence, Jukes Meat Market. But I love this place. It's like an old school, full service butcher shop. It's this incredible like beef jerky roadside stand. But they got one house specialty that's made right here in the back. Let's go check it out. This is where you'll find the real deal butcher shop that goes back to the 60s when it was started by the Juke Brothers. And this is Kenton Sims carrying on the third generation of family ownership and the making of their house specialty, raw meat parisa. And then one of the staples yeah. is the parisa, which is okay, it's Texas tartar, man. So it's seasoned ground round with cheese, onions, salt and pepper to taste, and you eat it just like that on a cracker. So man. We do, you, you say tartar, yep. makes me think it's raw. It is, it it's is. <laughs> There's nothing added to that to preserve it. It's just like eating a rare steak, you know, and it's 100% raw meat. Yep, raw, raw. And the locals can't get enough of it, as Juke sells hundreds of pounds a week. They say you never want to know how the sausage is made, but I gotta see this. So you got the round steak that we've trimmed the outside off of. You have the, the fresh onions, the super melt cheese that we use, and then the uh, green jalapenos. It, it's clean, right. no it's, bacteria It's the equivalent of eating a rare steak. You know, you kill all that bacteria on the outside. In this case, we remove it all. Yeah. So get after it. That's you know? awesome. That's we awesome. Re we recommend eating it within 24 hours. Okay. Uh, but we do have some folks that like to test that. You know? so. <laughs> some of the old timers. Oh yeah, like, oh yeah. That, I'm 80, it ain't killed me yet. Yeah, I'm Lone like... Star beer fixes anything, man. <laughs> <laughs> I know, I know, it doesn't look that appetizing or ready to eat at all. It looks like a big uncooked hamburger patty. That's it. Are you ready to try it or what? <laughs> Heck yeah, I am. Let's do it. Let's do it. Castro right, Bill Caviar. This is it, dude. Whatever you want. Get after it. Fresh jalapeno, cheese, great flavor up front. It's good stuff. A lot of onion. Mm -hmm. That's more than good stuff, dude. That's awesome. Oh, yeah. That is great. My brain doesn't want to think I'm eating raw meat. Yeah. My brain just wants to keep going after it. That's the hardest part for people to get over. Is mm -hmm. to go, really? We're really going to do we're, this? We're... <laughs> but once they do it, yeah. they're like, man, that's pretty good. Dude. You gotta try this. Mind over that's matter. Right. Oh, that's a lot. Okay. Or in this case, mind over Take meat. Go, go. But if my stomach's involved, wow. it trumps everything. Wow. Okay, that's good. <laughs> yeah. Oh yeah. Isn't that good? Winner, winner. Parisa yeah. dinner. Raw meat. <laughs> What I love about it is it's an old school thing. It this really isn't is. something new that some hipster in a fancy restaurant dreamed up. Yep. Like this is the way it's done by old timers in old town, small town meat yep. markets. For a long time, you know. Well, thank you, brother. No problem. That was fun. Thank you. Yeah, yeah heck yeah. Hey, Chet, I have a question. Mm -hmm. Can we get a meat grinder for the office? <laughs> <laughs> Little tabletop yeah. grinder, La Parisa yeah. for lunch. Why not? Cooking for me just got a whole lot easier. Yeah, I don't yeah. even have to start the fire, I just, you're Grind ready, it up. Ready to go. If you liked this video, chances are you're gonna love another video that's somewhere right about here. Or you can visit thedaytripper.com. But above all, what I want you to do most, remember the Alamo. I'll see all y'all out on the road. Bye, Condios, amigos.